To the latest on the deadly school shooting in Georgia, the 14 year old suspect and his father made their first court appearances this morning. The teen was charged as an adult with four counts of murder. His father also arrested and charged with murder in the rampage that left two students and two teachers dead. ABC's Morgan Norwood with what we learned from those hearings. Colt Gray, the 14-year-old accused in the mass shooting at Appalachian High School in Georgia, making his first court appearance. The teenager charged as an adult with four counts of felony murder. The judge laying out his rights, and Gray did not enter a plea. Less than an hour later, his father Colin, also arraigned, charged with two counts of second-degree murder, four counts of involuntary manslaughter, and eight counts of cruelty to children. The 54-year-old nervously rocking back and forth in his chair. These charges stem from Mr. Gray knowingly allowing his son, Colt, to possess a weapon. Sources tell ABC News investigators believe Colin gifted his teenage son with an AR-15 style rifle for Christmas, which authorities say he used to kill two teachers and two students. We're heartbroken. A young person brought a gun into a school committed an evil act and he took lives. ABC News also learning of potential miswarning signs. The FBI confirming they received anonymous tips as early as May of last year about a disturbing post Gray is believed to have made on the social media site Discord, where they say he had possibly threatened to shoot up a middle school the next day. According to the Jackson County Sheriff's Office, he denied making the post during an interview at the time. His father telling investigators there were guns at the house, but his son did not have unsupervised access, adding that his son was being picked on at school. Colt was never arrested, but later transferred to this new county, where authorities say Wednesday, he terrorized his own peers. Desks, chairs, whatever we could really put, we just put it in front of the door, uh, hoping um, the shooter won't come in. Really, it's just a scary. God was watching over us that day. Now, the judge initially said that Colt's four felony murder charges came with a maximum penalty of death or life in prison with or without parole. He then called him back inside the courtroom to state since he's underage, he can't face the death penalty. Colt and his father are due back in court on December 4th. Morgan Norwood, ABC News, New York.